Reporting in for Kentucky a few moments back. Here he is. He can shoot it. Freshman from Portland. The three. To sense Kentucky is just in a bit of a hurry here. Tipped out to Hulls. This could tie it. Watford does from outside. A three-pointer. This pace. It's been wild from the start. 45 all last minute. First half. Kid Gilchrist. And a foul. When you look at the stats for the first half. No way. Yes, a three. They rule it. To close the half. Davis passing inside. Kid Gilchrist. Gilchrist right underneath. And one. Over to Watford. Davis is out of position now. Watford in the paint. Zeller put back, yes. 82-77. And they like to play through Miller because he can do that. That's a on Remarkable. He's not like it's just one guy. I mean, it's everybody. Kentucky is moving on. The Wildcats. Shut up the heat of the second half and go on to a 102 to 90 victory. Expected lift for, for Michigan. I Albert mean, averages about one point a game. So for him to come in and knock down a three is just huge. Oh, he goes class and hits from downtown. Sharp pushing. And the foul. Looks like he actually lost the grip. Yeah minutes from a second half. Elijah Johnson for three. Stauskas to the rim, turned back, recovered by McGarry, and he backs it home. How about that with the right hand? When Salt's team had that trouble with the full court pressure. Huge possession right here for Michigan. Burke oh, for McGarry. Points, five rebounds, five assists. Michigan looking to hurry. Burke fires for three. Yes! Plus three by Trey Burke. Burke. Able to beat Johnson with that quick step. Three-point game. That's a lot of pressure here on this first one. And goes too strong. Three-point game. Burke moves it down. Five seconds. Fires for three. Is 4 of 11 for 10 points. Burke from straight away. Yes. Oh, he is on fire. How on where Wookie would have been in the play. Young switches out on defense. All right, here's Burke. And to the left hand. Rebound McGarry and scores. Michigan by three. Ecuador. Relford wants more help in the backcourt. Gets it in out of Johnson. Out of five. Here's Johnson. It up. Far past to get away. He it's a win. The Wolverines of Michigan come from 14 down to defeat the Jayhawks of Kansas in overtime in a thriller. Taylor, three seconds. Jumper hands off the board for three. from deep. This is Chase Fisher with a three. How about Chase Fisher with a three? Nice head fake there. Then a guy named Chase Fisher with a three from way out. I think it was six of 12 from deep on the game, but the threes weren't over. Skylar Hall for the lefty knocks down a triple, and then someone named Chase Fisher again for three. And then Tyler Hawes, how about a triple from him? Five of nine from range. Anson Winder getting in on the act. BYU shot 10 of 15 from range in the first half alone at the break. Second half now. Jarvis Summers finds MJ Rett for the alley -oop. Jam. He had 20 points on the game. The lead down to nine. Then Kyle Collinsworth with the alley-oop. Jam. He had 10 on the game. The lead 
down to five. Then stepping up the D and going on a run. Moody with the steal and the layup on flat. Off another steal. This is MJ Rep running the other way and getting the layup. How about a guy named MJ Rep again? This time inside with the two-handed throwdown. Then Stephen Moody getting involved. Outside, just pulling up and taking the shot. Look at Ole Miss. They've come back and taken the lead. We're tied at 82. Stephen Moody makes a three. He had a game high 26 7, 85, but BYU hanging around. Sebastian Saez with the layup inside with 30 to go. Puts them up 91 to 87, a four point lead, and that was their margin. Ole Miss advances 94 to 90. Sisters, a little dab, a little do ya. And here's Jackson rising up for three, and the friendly bounce. Jackson hits his second three pointer. With some size work versus Marcus Page. Page, right to Johnson, he's finally count the basket. Johnson goes strong. Pulls down the rebound. Bell pops across, trying to get Williams gone. Back to back, you bet. Troy Williams. Johnson up high, Theo Pinson. And going up top in the alley -oop. Bryce Johnson on the receiving end. Beautiful pass. At 41, and then they hung 83 on Providence. And Johnson goes to the hole and one. Johnson foul, got a chance at three. One point victory on March 11th at the ACC tournament in D.C. But they are familiar foes, they know each other well. Seven off turnovers for K-State. Each team with seven turnovers. And firing up a three and hitting a three is Brian Crawford who proved the defensive intensity. Let's see if it plays out that way. Nice. Nope. One do, a two-handed jam. What a pass. Robicon on the floor. And going up top for Collins to catch in the dunk. How about that ATO? We've seen a couple of them. And Wundu able to turn the corner with the left. He's fouled. It goes. Three-point chance. Wesley Wundu will head to the line. DJ Johnson wide open. That was one of seven assists for Wesley. As well, I think the seventh straight year that Mick Cronin has the Bearcats in the tournament. And there's a three. Meneglu hits a long three. First win in five years at the NCAA tournament for Kansas State. Floor. Jones down low. Kick out. There's Scruggs. And there's the three. It's good. Stolen by Jefferson. Jefferson with three seconds. Jefferson trying to beat the buzzer. Jefferson scores at the horn. And another flex. Yeah. There's Cantor baseline. Reverse is good. Karen Cantor. Lewitt, foot on the line. Two won't go. Oops, hit by Jones. Jones gets it back. Jones up strong. Counter in the foul. This is Xavier's 55th NCAA tournament game. Second most points they've scored. And count that one for McCurry. And Xavier is moving on. One oh two eighty three the final no goal attempts. Here's Eifert for three. Yes. Williams on Harms. Four and a half to go in the first half. Tennessee wants to change around. They're in a the full court press. Oh. And Edward says you could be in my jersey with me, and I'll still knock this shot down. Williams may say, hey coach, Harms is doing a great job inside. I'm trying to get some looks. Klein again. That's a long two for Ryan Klein. He's hot. Ten in the half for Ryan Klein. Here's Bowden. Four, three. And a foul. And count it. Schofield going to work. No gel. Eastern on. Oh, what a flurry of moves by Admiral Schofield. Extended it to 18. Here is Turner. And we are tied. Lamonte Turner buries another triple. Behind the back. Edwards checks him. Here's Bowden now. 
And Schofield, a long three. You bet! Admiral Schofield has given Tennessee the lead. Three. He's going to have to take a long one. Climb, step back, three for the tie. Oh! He's done it again! Big free throw, clutch by Carson Edwards. Good comeback to force overtime. Car fly open for a jam! Set up by Eifert. Well, this one coming to the finish line. Schofield will get the last bucket in his illustrious Tennessee career. And the Purdue Boilermakers out of the Big Ten headed to the Elite Eight.